because I want to show you how you can take penalties and how to take the perfect penalty in FC25. Now, penalties, just keep things very, very simple without going over this. There's five zones. There's top left. There's bottom left. There's top right. And there's bottom right. And then there's middle. So if you want to aim the shot, for example, in the bottom left, do you see my left analog stick? I'm aiming at the bottom left. If you want to aim the shot at the top left, again, you can just take the shot and aim at the top left like so. And same if you want to go to the bottom right or to the bottom or to the middle, it's the exact same thing. Now, the key thing is this composure ring. Now, this composure ring expects and contrasts depending on your player's ability on penalties. So, I mean, composure stat. So, the higher the composure stat, the slower this will contract and expand. If you've got low composure, this will be shaking all over the place. The penalty stat is important because it affects placement and the aim of the shot. But the most important is power. If you want to score the perfect penalty, you need to hit it 90%. Make sure it's 90% because if you go 100%, you can still miss the penalty. So what you want to do is you want to get it beyond the goalkeeper's reach. And you do that by, let's say I go to the bottom left. Now, which you're going to get this when it's at the smallest point, because that will give you the most accuracy for the penalty. And we'll load about 90% bar, 90% uh, power, and the ball will go into the corner beyond the goalkeeper's reach. And that is how you take penalties very, very easily. And of course, if you want to, you can take chip penalties or finesse penalties, whatever you want to do. Like if you do a, a chip penalty, and if you want to do a finesse shot penalty, you can do the same. But a normal power shot penalty is more than good enough. Just don't forget, whenever you're doing this, make sure you go for power because if you don't do enough power, you could be screwed. But equally, if you do too much power, you're in trouble. So if you're not too sure, just keep it around 70%. If you can go for it, go for the 90% because you can see sometimes the goalkeeper can save it. That is why I try to aim for the bottom and I try to go for 90% power so it goes beyond the goalkeeper's reach. And that's how you take penalties in a nutshell. If you want to see more videos like this, come to my Patreon series, patreon.com forward slash no guys. Click the link down below in the description. Thanks for watching. Peace out.